The rest will stay here in camp. V, you're here. I want patrols every... What is he doing here? I forbade you from even breathing on that Militech convoy, so you call in your friend? To do it all behind my back? Is that it? Uh-huh. That's exactly why I had V come and stand right in Got front... Got no fucking clue what's going on here. Damn it to hell, Saul. Are you seriously considering letting that basilisk slip yeah, through buddy. our fingers? Yeah, yeah, buddy. But a chance like this. A chance at what? Rotting up the job we came here to do? Get the sense this fight's grown stale. Come on, put some feeling into it. No. This discussion ended long ago. The Biotechnica people will be here in an hour. Try not to cock anything else up before then. I can't believe it. Look, there he goes, off to paint the grass green. I thought the Biotechnica contract had withered and died. Saul insists we see it through to the end. To prove the Aldecaldos keep their word. Crop protection? Who gives a damn about crop protection? All Saul is going to prove is that a corp can walk all over us. And we'll say thank you and ask for more. What's this basilisk nonsense? It's an armored Militech cargo panzer. Junk from back in 2060 or so. They want to pedal it off to a backwards country. Somewhere it can still pass as a technological wonder. The Militech convoy will take the 101 right past us. Shame not to say hello. Is this basilisk worth another fight with Saul? Yes. A craft like that would finally put us back on the right path. The family is falling apart. If we fall into this biotechnica rut, no one will ever take us seriously again. Okay. So you do want to go behind Saul's back and drag me here specifically for that? Yes. Cassidy, Ted, Carol, and Bob also on board. Um... Why Saul got his briefs in a bunch over this basilisk? He's afraid Militech will destroy us if we pick a fight with it. He thinks it's safer to stick with the corporations. Like Biotechnica. <laughs> what a joke. You guys would rather... We would rather go back to plying the trade we know best. Logistics. Meaning smuggling. That's what I said. And you plan to grab the basilisk how? Thanks, V. Oh, we don't grab it. help just yet. Okay, let's go talk to the rest. This all seems like a very well put together plan that's going to go perfectly fine and nobody's going to get hurt. So, just the four vets on board with the plan. Nobody else? We didn't bother asking the others. There was too great a risk someone would take it to Saul. Besides, only the vets understand what we have to gain by having a basilisk. Sounds pretty risky to me. On the contrary, easy as pie. There won't even be much security on the convoy. Plus, we'll be doing our part towards furthering the cause of world peace. Aren't I supposed to be here Why for a funeral? Why this beast wind up being used in some little third world skirmish? We'll make better use of it right here in America. Did you try to get Saul on board again? No luck, huh? No. Okay, everyone listen. Militech will transport the basilisk in parts distributed across two trucks. Wait, do I sense a quiver in your voice? Fuck you! The convoy will halt at the railroad crossing on the 101. We'll attack from behind, then get the hell out and away. Questions? Comments? Motions? It's all too... easy. Convenient to arrange. The exact tech you need. Coming your way almost served on a silver platter. Yes, Saul also claimed it stinks the high heaven. Sounds like Saul has some sense. Where'd you get it? Carol hacked the Militech comms channel. Is that enough for you? Okay. Yeah, fuck it. I'm in. I'll follow my woman. Oh. Okay. Thanks. First, we'll ride to the station. The train engine we need to block the convoy's way is there. Are you riding with us, or will we meet you there? I riding guess I'm riding you. with. Excellent. Let's get going. Should at least switch the mission. I think 
I heard a little shake in that voice. You did not. Ah, come on. Did you get your hands clammy too? Screw you. If this but is the mission I think it is, cool stuff's happening. Are you trying to insult me, Bobby? Okay, okay. Forget I even asked. All right, we're gonna talk or? Let's go. Oh, okay. Nobody's gonna notice you gone back at camp. Oh, that's not this one. Wish to see us there anyway. Darn. A good second it's okay. Biotechnica suits. Your sour faces wouldn't help much. Indeed, they would not. Oh, that's right. It's the next one or the one after that, right? The Raffins, what about them? You expecting any trouble? Saul is. He's posted sentries all around the camp. How's that not right? He's wrong in continuing to fight the symptoms rather than the disease. You don't miss life in Night City? At times, perhaps. I miss the feeling of having a new beginning. Of freedom. But I also haven't forgotten the emptiness. The feeling of realizing it means nothing if you're alone. Yeah. Took adjustment on my part, too. Though, uh... Never was completely alone. You had someone? A true friend. Jackie by name. You would have liked him, actually. Jackie? I'll remember that. Yeah, Jackie. We have arrived. Damn. Big bastard. Like it so much, maybe we should just hijack the train. Let the basilisk go on its way. Yeah, then just drive this beast to the 101. There and back. Saul would be on board with that. Okay, what are we doing, fellas? Are we ready? Lady fellas. Okay. The Militech convoy will be traveling from Night City to the base where they're due to meet the buyer. We will stop it at the railroad crossing. All we have to do is shove this beauty in its way. V, any questions? Plan to move this thing how exactly? It's old tech. Carol will have to hack it. Then I'll somehow have to finagle authorization from the control tower to move it. Tower looks inactive to me too. Yeah, we'll see to that. You and Pan Am just get the authorization code. Okay, let's get to work. Yeah, let's let's do it. Let's do the thing. What are we doing? Where are we doing it? Ooh, shoddy. Oh, I love loot and stuff. That was quick. Looking good, brother. Looking good. What is up, Castaway? How we doing? It was great seeing you the other day. Glad you could make it. The stairs it is, then. Oh, was I supposed to take an elevator? You think I can loot in here? Do you need a light? We love looting things. We sure do love looting stuff. Hey guys, little reminder, don't forget to like the stream. And if you have not subscribed yet, please subscribe. It helps me out tremendously. It gets me in front of more people. And the more people we get here, well, I just think that's pretty good. I just think that's a good thing. Yes, those. When you see them from above, you feel free. Like you could set off in a thousand journeys all at once. Perhaps more simply, hopeful. I'm playing too while looking at your stream. Let's go. Awesome. It was great seeing you too. Heck yeah, man. Heck yeah. Come on, B. Talk we to the to do, list. do we? Carol, what are we looking for? I was wondering where everybody was. It's taking forever to load. What cards? Oblong cards, holes in rows and columns. Okay. Would you help me look? Yeah, I can do sure that. Thing. Some sort of Stone Age control panel. 
Nothing here. Dried meat? Hell yeah, dude. Who doesn't love a little bit of dried meat? New threat level, high alert. Um, I feel like we got cursed by reading that. Hey, man, what do you think I'm doing? Nothing here. Hmm. Well, well, well. Would you look at that? Got something. Good job. You cool? You just, you've been acting real weird since we got on this mission there, Pan Am. Real impatient. Here goes Awfully enough. rude to a guy who saved your ass a hundred times. Couple squabbles, am I right? It worked. Come look. Little engine that could. So we're just blocking it off, I think, and then whenever they get stopped, we'll v, unleash hell. I wanted to speak with you. Missed you. Pretty bad. Oh, well, this means... Oh, wait, just, just wait. This is not how we usually talk. No time like the present. Okay. Go ahead. That was a joke. Listen, V, I believe I know where this is going. And not to your liking? No, it's not that. I also wish to talk about it, just not so openly. My plan was to tiptoe around, test the waters, then retreat back into my shell. Sounds like a plan. What went wrong? It seems you saw right through me. Didn't have a clue how you'd react. You're not the only one shooting in the dark. I would not want to cock this up. Well, that's a start. The thing is, I usually act before I think. Uh-huh, noticed. I know, but I also need impulses to act upon. When I do something spontaneously, I feel I'm being honest. Yet with you, I prefer to play it safe. Why is it any different with me? Because I truly care this time. Yet I fear I'll do or say something foolish and be left alone in the desert. I would rather keep you close. If only as a friend. Oh, fuck that. Try following the impulse next time. Okay. Well, in any case, you've been warned. All right. Let's rejoin the others. It's progress. We're making progress. Bees a smoothie. Convoy. Got eyes and ears on it? Yes. Carol checks their communication channels from time to time. Everything is proceeding as planned. For now. Man, everybody's so slow. Not everybody can be a fast ninja like me, though. I get it. Oh, shit. Do you know where Pan Am is? For crying out loud, I don't care what's going on between you two. I'm just asking. Can't give me a straight answer. When you see her, tell her I'm looking for her. Okay. I guess this is a good way as any to wait for the job to start. If Pan Am ever shows up.
We could still Sit your ass down a minute, honey. Now breathe. Everything's under control. The convoy is already heading our way. Hurry up and wait then. Quite some time left till dusk. Hmm. The car could use another once over. No conversation, huh? Okay. The stars have emerged. We've but a few hours till dawn. So what are we doing? You're acting spooked. As if you're the first person ever to stand up to Saul. Ah, save your breath. I don't need to be consoled. Ah, was it someone I know? New. No. Scorpion. You came home from the war, head full of new ideas and a host of new contacts. He tried to get Saul to lead us in joining Snake Nation. It would make us stronger, he said. I don't think he peeped a word of it to me. What did Saul do? Saul dressed the guy down head to toe for messing with the family. Hell, he didn't send him on any jobs for a year. Gee, really consoling. Thanks. You said yourself you didn't need any. Um. Ought to yeah. raise a glass to Scorpion. To Scorpion. Yeah, to our boy. And to Jackie. Oh. How nice. How nice of her. Look at those dead eyes. What's going on? I actually want to hear about the war. About the war much. What's there to say? They just packed you into a panzer down in Mexico and said full speed ahead, soldier. And it was weeks talking either to yourself or the onboard AI. Drinking iodide like water because your Geiger wouldn't shut up. Mm-hmm. I'm sprouting a rash on my ass just thinking about sitting in that boiling hot coffin. Uh-huh. But you all can't wait to pack your asses into the basilisk, huh? That's different. Completely different. You'll see once you're on board. I'm gonna yep. try and get some sleep. Okay. It'll be quite some time before the convoy comes through. You couldn't sleep see? if you tried, could you? Did you just doze off? I'll just lie here a while. By your side, gazing at the stars. Is that another area of your expertise? You got maps of the heavens in your library, too? Of course. That's the Big Dipper. And do you see the small flickering star to the right? Great. Supposed to be like a little bit bugged, that's just not showing the dialogue options, it's taking forever. Okay. Is it bugged? Oh, look at the stars. Uh, yeah. You do? Oh dear. That means there's a major leak. Good night, B. All right. Almost time for some action. <laughs> 